Hello and welcome to a Tabletop Bellhop Cardboard Coat Check. I am Mo Tuzano, the Tabletop Bellhop, your Cardboard Concierge, the RPG Maitre d', answering your gaming and game night questions and striving to make everyone's gaming experience better. Today the question I'm ask, answering is um, what you get, I guess, I was going to say what's in the box, but there's not really a box, but what you get with this, which is the One Ring, Lore Master Screen, and Rivendell Compendium. This is from Free League Publishing for the new second edition of the One Ring role-playing game set in the, obviously, in the Middle Earth, the Lord of the Rings setting. Um, the first box set was the starter set. There's also a big core rulebook. This is the third published um, piece of material for this game. Should be a quick one. I don't know how much you're going to get to see in here. Obviously, a DM screen, probably some type of source book. I'm not sure. But I do what we'll do is read off the back for those who want to know a little more. A deluxe lore master screen in landscape format for the second edition of the One Ring role-playing game. Features beautiful art on the outside and a host of useful tables and important information on the inside, while keeping the lore master schemes hidden from the eyes of inquisitive players. The Rivendell Compendium contains information about the last homely house, including a map of the valley and a plan of the house itself. Some of Rivendell's inhabitants are included, including Elrond, who can be used as a new patron. Finally, there are also new rules for how to create high elf player heroes. So there's a lot more in here than I expected. Not just a source book, but now you can play high elves and we have a new patron. So that's cool. Always like it when you get more than you expect with any tabletop gaming product. Enough about that, though. Let's take a look at what you get inside or get with the One Ring Lore Master Screen and Rivendell Compendium. All right, here you have the, the now, all I've done is cut the shrink wrap off. Uh, looks like we have a couple different things. We have books, we have a, a sheet. So let's kind of split these out. This was just on the back, so I don't think there's any reason to keep this. We have a booklet. This reminds me of the booklets that come in the starter set, same style. And this is your Rivendell source book, which is surprisingly shorter than the Shire source. We're going to just flip through this very quickly. Oh, that looks cool. I love the artwork in this RPG. Um, we're looking at the same two-column format, beautiful edges, call-outs. We've got some nice maps. Wow, the House of Elrond does not look as what, quite what I expected it to look like. And it's got some nice line art. Love the black and white artwork in this game. Not a ton of information. Um, you only have eight pages on Rivendell itself. And then we have 10, a two page, three pages on high to make, how to make high elf characters in the One Ring role playing game. All the players love having new options, so can't complain about that at all. Then we've got this, and somewhere there should be a map. Is that inside here maybe? So we do have a horizontal DM screen. I didn't see maps, unless they were just talking about, like is this your map of Rivendell? I guess this is it. Yeah, okay, so... When it said maps on the outside, I was expecting like fold out maps, not just here's your map of Rivendell, and then here you have your map of the Homely Home, the House of Elrond. Not quite what I was expecting. I, I expected some kind of physical map. Um, what I will probably do is swap the camera so you can see all this artwork at once. Here you have the artwork on the, the DM screen, GM screen, the lore master screen. Let me correct myself here. Artwork on the lore master screen, what the characters will see. And then on the other side, you have a bunch of charts useful for the Game Master, or the Lore Master. I'm going to keep doing that because I, I'm so I'm old school. I'm the same Game Master. So we'll take a bit of a close-up look at each section of this as best I can, holding it up. So we're looking at special success table, risk levels, conditions, adversary special damage options, complications and advantages. Then we move on to the middle with when to roll, endurance, resting, first aid, Sources of Injury, Wound Severity, and Council Structure. And then we finally move over to Journey Rolls, Marching Tests, Perilous Areas, Journey Event Tables, Source of Dread, Sources of Shadow, and Misdeeds. And that's it. Folds up nicely. Nice, solid, thick. You can kind of see how thick this is here. I personally love horizontal DM screens. And then we have a nice little Rivendell source book that goes with it. With, of course, bonus rolls for playing High Elves in the One Ring. So that was a nice short one. Quick look at what you get with the One Ring 
Lore Master Screen, and Rivendell Compendium. Compendium's a little shorter than I was expecting. I was expecting a thicker book, but fair enough. They don't spend a lot of time in Rivendell. So that's fair. Um, beautiful looking book, great layout, black and white line art, no full color images actually anywhere. No, that's not true. The maps are actually full color, they're just muted. Muted colors. And then a nice landscape DM screen. I personally love landscape DM screens with lots of the useful tables the lore master may need while running the one ring. That's pretty much it. That's what you get in the box. I guess it's not a box, in the sleeve. Shrink, this is it. This is what you get, all this stuff. I am Motuzno, Tabletop Bellhop, your cardboard concierge, answering your game game night questions and striving to make everyone's gaming experience better. You can send those questions to questions at tabletopbellhop.com or head over to the webpage, tabletopbellhop.com, and click on Ask the Bellhop. I'm also all over the internet as Tabletop Bellhop, one word, and if you want to ask me a question on social media, I'll be sure to answer you there as well. Thank you for joining me for a look at what you get in the Lord of the Rings, sorry, the One Ring, Lore Master Screen, and Rivendell Compendium. Good afternoon, and game on.